So Abby's been surfing for about two and a half years, but the truth of it is she's actually a better surfer than I am. <laughs> can barely stay up on one board. She's got, she's got two now. came down to the beach, I like to swim in the ocean a lot, and uh, got on the board one day and took off, much to my chagrin, because, like I said, I can't surf. On the main side of Silicon Valley, and someone found her on the street, she was almost dead, and um, she was really traumatized, so we did a lot, we did a lot of sports together, and uh, you know, kind of bonded through sports. She's a really active dog, and she came out of her shell. Running together, biking. Uh, she's paraglides, she sheep herds, and now she surfs. From Royal Canaan Dog Food. A gift basket including dog supplies and treats from My Paws. The big best in surf trophy. And probably as important, if not more important than any of the rest of it, one year of bragging rights. <laughs> Anybody says anything to you on the beach? Show them your trophy. The winner of Best in Surf at Helen Woodward Animal Center's fifth annual Surf Dog Surfathon is capping it off with what may be the best surf move in surf dog history, right? With a score of 21.7. Michael, congratulations. Are we going to see you and Abby back here next year? I hope so. It's just an honor to come out here and have fun and surf with all these amazing dogs. So we just had a blast. <laughs> Icing on the cake. Thank you so much. Terrific. And uh, Jagger was talking about uh, Abby the surfboard sailor. Why, well, for the folks that maybe didn't see that move, Jagger, well, what? explain it. Well, it was a great move. She hit about her, connected to about her third wave. And on the third wave, she bumped with another dog, and I'm not even sure who that was. But Stanley, bumped with Stanley, Stanley fell off his board, Abby jumped on Stanley's board, and finished the wave on Stanley's board. So Stanley and Abby made history with the best surf move ever at Surf Dog. Congratulations. I think we had a lot of tape rolling on that when that happened. Between the two of you, the, a, a credit to both of your dogs. Both of your dogs went with it. When they rolled with the punches, they made it happen. It was, yeah, congratulations to you. They, they improved it. Okay, I don't want to over-dramatize this, but it gave me chills when I saw that happen. <laughs> Stanley jumped off the board, the board came over, Abby's board went over, went over. Abby had that instinct and just jumped right over from her board onto Stanley's board. It was a beautiful move, one of the most amazing things we've seen in five years of Surf Dog Surfathon competition. No barking at the judge shirt which doesn't apply we encourage barking at the judges all the way along mike thank you very much okay here comes pat weber from san diego surfing academy we surf here about uh, three four times a week all year round and, uh, it's actually the reason why we never do well at this contest we just got to go out and it's like playing and then i don't know this year we got lucky so it was a lot of fun and uh, how about uh, in terms of supporting Helen Woodward, is that something that's important to Abby? It's great. Like I said, she's a rescue dog, so we support all rescue shelters and their efforts. And Helen Woodward is one of the best shelters in this area. This is fabulous. They put on this great contest for the last four or five years, and all the proceeds go to helping animals. So you can't, uh, can't fault that. Oh, yeah. Another one of the folks that has been with us since the very beginning. <laughs>